This is the one we've been waiting for, Jason, the main event of the evening. The Triton True Heavyweight Championship. And it's followed by one-on-one -on -one with Samuel Shaw. And no pun intended, Jeff, this could be Samuel Shaw's biggest title defense to date. You're absolutely correct. People are solidly behind. Wow. Collar and elbow top, center of the ring, followed by and Samuel Shaw for the tried and true heavyweight championship. Look at the power of the big Filipino. A show of strength in the early going of this one. He's going to let Samuel Shaw know he needs business, buddy. Don't sell Samuel Shaw short. He has defended his TNT title numerous times. And he's a thinking man's wrestler. And he's had never some, count him out. He's had some talk about, I mean, you're talking about the likes of the Monster Abyss. Tommy Dreamer, ECW original. I mean, Samuel Shaw has really had a lot of tough competition in his run as tried and true heavyweight champion, and he's put them all away. That's true. And let me tell you, you know, people may not agree with everything he does, but he's a fighting champion. He takes on any and all covers. These people are solidly behind Fala Bar. John back and forth with the fans here. A lot of tension, folks, if you've been following anything uh, the past couple of weeks here in trying true wrestling between Samuel Shaw and our, our radio DJs to help sponsor and promote our events. Samuel Shaw hasn't done a good job of making friends here in Tried and True, that's for sure. Well, but he doesn't have fact, to. Justin. When you're the champion, Jeff, you know Whoa. as well as anybody, you've got a target on your back at all times. Absolutely. You can't make friends with all those enemies. Oh, my God. Did you see that ring move? Whoa. Samuel Shaw is feeling the effects of that. Did you see that ring when he slammed him in that corner? That ring moved six inches. Falaba came charging in like a freight train. Samuel Shaw was on the receiving end of it and still feeling it. Falaba standing in the ring waiting. He needs to get out there and stay on Samuel Shaw. Don't give him a chance. Shaw slides in enough, enough to break the referee's count, and he's right back out. I think what Falaba needs to do is go out and make Samuel Shaw get back in that ring. He can't win the title on the floor. Shaw taking his precious time here. Of course, a count out would mean that Shaw retains the title. It's exactly. obviously not the outcome we hoped for exactly. in this match. Exactly. He's manipulating everything he can. Oh, wait a minute. He got a little too close that time. Oh. Shaw in, rolls over, another backdrop attempt, but to no avail. The drop kick, but it's still not come in, come up in. The Beautiful drop kick, but the big man is still on his feet. Oh my God. He could have broke him in two. There is no way that Samuel Shaw's rib cage is intact after that. Are you kidding? That was 420 pounds 
doing a cross body block. Oh! Uh, he's steamrolling Jason James. That was a Cleveland steamer. He's from the Philippines. Well, maybe it was the Philippines steamer, but he's steamrolling. Samuel Shaw is in La La Land. He's on Dream Street right now. He's grabbed a chair at ringside. I still can't get it. Wait a minute. Samoa drop. Once again, that back of Samuel Shaw driven into the mat. I'm still shocked at 420 pounds going to fight cross body. And the vertical height he got over, Jason. Hard knife edge chop. Falaba is starting to get into rhythm now. Starting to feel. What's he doing here? Oh, wait a minute. Oh! He just flattened the chair. It's a good thing Samuel Shaw got out of the way. Can you imagine what he would look like? Look at that chair. It's destroyed. But worse than that, fall Bob. The back of his head bouncing off that lower turnbuckle. His neck could be severely injured. Samuel Shaw follows up. Driving the elbow into the top of the head, driving that spine, compressing it. The right hand to the jaw. Another one. Whoa, wait a minute. Boss got different plans in mind. But Shaw, that boot to the midsection. Sunset flip. Wait a minute. No. Oh. The oh. oh. good thing Samuel Shaw got out of the way. Oh, oh, right to the back of the head once again, working on his neck. Couldn't have planted that one more perfectly. That's just a two count ball. Oh, my gosh. That kick right to the back of the skull. Shaw in control now, choking him on the ropes. This fall of all reminds me of a young Coquino Maximus who later went on to become the great Yokozuna. But in his infancy, he was a tough, tough kid just like this fall of all. Trading chops. Big four. Chop. Four. Shaw. Oh, my Had him up, he just couldn't rotate him. That back given out from earlier. Alabad worked over that back earlier, and then let Samuel Shaw down. You look at Shaw, look at the shape he's in and the strength, but that back took a beating. Ah, with those chops, sends him down sideways again, plants him on the chest. Samuel Shaw, better look out here. Alaba has found new life in this matchup. Beautiful belly to belly suplex. This could be it. Oh, two and a half. Both men making their way back to their feet. Shaw went for a super kick. Oh! Hey. He took it for a ride. This could be it. Oh! I thought that was it, Jason. I thought we had a new champion. And again, Falaba is in disbelief. He can't believe it. Oh, he 
caught him in midair. Samoa drop. And this has got to do it. No! How did he get that shoulder? I don't understand, Jeff. This is against all every bit of logic and my goodness. Samuel Shaw should have been put away multiple times. It just goes to show you the caliber of champion that Samuel Shaw is. Whether you like him or not, he's a tough man. And he gives no quarter and asks none. But this is going to be it. If Falabar lands this, Sam can kiss it goodnight. No! He's up. Oh! Got him right in the back of the knee and the hamstring with that kick. Oh! Super kick. Right across the face. Oh, that time. What a tremendous night, what a card. This has been unbelievable. Wait, what is Shaw doing? What's Shaw doing? You already beat him, Sam. Come on. That was totally unfair. He retained the title. This what is, are you doing, Jason? This is unnecessary here. Samuel Shaw is just, oh he's already God. proven himself to be the top contender here. He's proven himself to be a worthy champion, but this is disgraceful. What is Sam doing? Come on, Sam. Wait, the lights are out. What's going on? Wait a minute, the lights are out. What in the world? That's crazy Steve! Crazy Steve's in the ring! Oh! Oh, he blew the mist! He spits the blood in the face of Samuel Shaw! Unbelievable! Although we're almost out of time, and Crazy Steve's got a microphone. Don't cut those cameras yet. Keep them rolling.